This is my pet peeve. Boy, look how long that right hand is. Still see to get it right. Get it right, still see it. Look how long that right hand is, because he getting full extension. A right hand is longer than a jab. A boxing right hand. It's not just a punch like a jab. That's a full extended jab. Matter of fact, it's a one-two. And that is how that is how you generate power, not with a power modifier. For y'all who don't know, that's Buster Douglas. Look how long that jab is, and look at Mike Tyson going up under that. A punch in the back of the head should not score. A punch in the back should not score as a head shot. Will Kinsler, go back to three points to the head, three points to the body, and, bo and punches glancing off of arms and backs. Can we get away from this arcade street fighter game? You see the punch came right behind the other punch. That's how you gain, that's how you get power in boxing. The other, one punch set up one punch. Boom, one, two, see? See, one, two. Another thing, that punch, that punch went over his head, right? That punch went over his head. I got a pet peeve with that, right? So that's Buster Douglas. For the news out there who don't understand boxing, go watch it when you understand who Buster Douglas is, right? If you don't know, Juan Manuel Marquez is the guy who fought Manny Pacquiao. Who knocked out Manny Pacquiao and they had trilogies. So let's look at, see? That's one where one where one one man where Marquez is. That's Marquez. Known as one of the most technical boxers in boxing history. So that's Marquez. Right? Here's Eric Morales and Marco Antonio Barrera. Alright? Where Morales at? I got to do this like this. My channel ain't big. I got a PC over there. But I'm not going to be sitting over there making these doggone hour-long videos and don't nobody watch them. I'm not going to waste, waste my time. See? Eric Morales versus Manny Pacquiao. Let's skip forward. Right? And then we got Eric Morales versus Marco Antonio Barrera. So these, this is the Mickey Ward Arturo Gotti at the lightweight. Wow, Steel City, you sure got the fight. Can we please get the technique? He better have Tapia on the back of his shorts. And terribly, but well, it's in English now. Terrible. Eric Morales. He should have thrown a jab. He, his best punch is his straight right hand. And not power straight right hand. Where he loading up. Boxing, in boxing, is not a power modifier. It's a punch combination. The jab set up the punch for momentum and it makes power. The jab turns the next punch into power. The punch with the right technique causes power. You need to do something else with this R2 button. Like the feints. Uh, and that's where video games get it wrong every time. Because they think it's a power modifier. No. It's a setup with the jab in a right hand coming behind the jab. If you make up your own stuff in boxing, it's not going to look like boxing. It's going to turn into something else. That's why guys on this game um, is able to throw um, single punches and win. And that's basically looking for the knockout. 
See how you threw that one too? See? Let's get to the other boxes. I ain't even got to look at the list. I know who all in the game. Oh, um, uh, the guy who fought Tyson Fury, right? Otto Wilder. Let's take a look at Otto Wilder, right? It's going to pop up. Otto Wilder. Take a look at Otto Wilder versus Dylan White or Tyson Fury. They making real boxing matchups in this game, and y'all just not appreciate it because you're not boxing fans. And you think you get butt hurt when I tell you you're not boxing fans, even though it's true. So that's out of wild, right? A beautiful addition to undisputed boxing game. Right? They got real current boxers. And not a whole bunch of legends that we've seen before in other boxing games. Um, who else they got? They got the, the, um, the, um, Jake Paul pack. Who came with Jake Paul? I forgot. I forgot who came with Jake Paul. Oh, yeah. Zeely Zane and who's that? Yeah, uh, 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 Juan Romero Marquez. Okay, I went over him. And then Zeely Zane, right? Zeely Zane is a. Let's see if I can spell his name. Is a silver medalist in boxing, right? He's a silver medalist, right? So you see, he knocked out of Deontay Wilder and gave Joseph Parker a good fight. He also fought Joe Joyce. But we're going to go to the Olympics, right? Because you guys don't understand boxing. Stop getting butt hurt because somebody telling the truth. Anthony Joshua knocking down Zeke Zane. There goes Zeke Zane right there. Southpaw, knock him down, see? And guess what the punch for the Southpaw is? The cross. And he's stepping on his feet. That happens in boxing, though. That's a technique. It's dirty, but it's a technique. It happens in boxing. This happened in London in 2012. So 13 years ago. The right cross is the South Park killer. You can, you can lead it too. Because it looked like a jab from that side except it's a power shot. And most South Paws can't see it coming. Now you can't spam it on a real boxer because they'll counter it. We need more devils, we need one punch knockout counters to be turned up in a realistic way. Ethan, bring it back. You had it right. So I'm listening to Will. Will don't know nothing about no damn boxing. And his fans don't know, they're not even excited about these fighters because they don't understand boxing and they don't really follow boxing like that. So they go Zilly Zang. <laughs> And guess who else? Joe Joyce. Guess what? They both in the game. So you can get this matchup. All day long. I mean, it's easy work. This is right. So you guys is not excited because you're not boxing fans. You fighting game fans. They got him. Right. What's up, bro? Yeah. What's going on? That's my guy. Um. Let me go forward. Here we go. All right. So we got one with Mel Marquez. We got Roy Jones Jr. Outfits. Deontay Wilder new outfits. I hope we got that um 
that outfit he fought in uh, Tice Fury the second that black one. Um, and I pretty much went over all these fighters, but Sonny Edwards got a new, um, I'm quite sure he's going to have on the outfit he had when he retired, when he fought um, this last fight. The silly Loma Chinko, that green is the Matrix. They used to call him the Matrix. So y'all going to have to unloose footwork, go from the top view, camera view, so we can use angles and stop playing this game like it's a, 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 a street fighter game. And, 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 and people wanting to play on the left or right side. Let us move around the ring freely. If a person get behind the back and hit him in the head, the referee say no hit behind the head and disqualify. Can we get a sport and not a fighting game? Beast.